Welcome to I'm Your Target Demographic and welcome to Word Up. Today we are looking at the word shipping. And not shipping like getting something shipped, but shipping like something else. The definition here is the support of or particular interest in a romantic pairing between two characters in a fictional series. So people get very attached to their fandom, the things that they love, and sometimes they want characters to end up together that maybe don't in the continuity. If you saw Star Wars The Force Awakens, you might ship Rey and Finn. You also might ship Finn and Poe, especially after you see that lip bite delivered by Oscar Isaac. The word shipping comes from the word relationship, and it was shortened to shipping. Easy as that. Commonly, people will ship two characters in fan fiction, which is fiction written by the fans, so it's not in continuity. Uh, an example is Harry and Hermione from Harry Potter. Uh, there's people that believe they should have ended up together, so they will write fictional stories about the future that they might have had. With shipping, people also come up with cute little nicknames for the couple, such as if you were shipping Black Widow and Hawkeye, Clint and Natasha, you might say Clintasha. Or if you were shipping Steve Rogers and Bucky, you might say Stucky. To take this another step further, people have started to ship real people together, wishing that two people would end up together. Uh, and to take this even a step further, there is fiction about real people called real person fiction. So fictional stories about a person as a character, but it's like Chris Evans as Chris Evans in the story writing about what Chris Evans would do. We're going down a huge rabbit hole here, so we're going to come back. Here's another example of how to use shipping in a sentence. I love Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. I'm really shipping Phil and Melinda May. Easy as that. Now you know what it means. Now you know how to use it. And we'll see you next time on Word Up.